Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. So glad you guys could be here. I'm Rooster. Right now we're playing Starfield and we're about to dive into some power from beyond. That's right. We got to go find ourselves some new powers and unlock the universe. So make sure you guys like, subscribe and hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on anything coming down the line. So we're going to head to Planet Firma 3. I don't know what the power is, so you got to stick with us and let's go find out what we got. Let's go kick it. Okay, guys, when we starting off here, we got to go talk to Vladimir every single time. He's going to be at the lodge now since we were attacked by the Starborn and he's got the info we want. Sweet. Well, that's fun. Now with that taken out of consideration, we're going to go to Fermi 3. And like I said, just click on it. We're a little bit out of range. So what we do is we just go back one planet and do a small jump. Because unless you have enough fuel in your spaceships. Yeah. When you get to the planet, make sure you scan it when you're coming into it to find out what's going on. This one looks like it's got a lot of stuff right nice and easy. Right off the landing strip. I like that. So... See how our scanner kind of distorts? We're going to follow that distortion. And I love to scan things as we're going. It helps out for later on when we need to survey the whole planet. All right. So this is pretty much easy. You just grab everything as you're running by. You never know. With um, fauna, fluoride, and resources being a six, six, or 868, it's not a bad planet to have a, a setup. The air seems pretty decent. Could be a good little base. Now, this is Temple Row. So let's go inside and see what powers are being held for us. Please take your time, Mr. Lego. Open up. When you get inside here, by now, you guys should all know that there's going to be these little stars that all like cluster together. And as we hit them, the sound is going to start ruminating through and letting us know that we're on the right track. It's like we're hitting the different notes to find the secrets of the universe. And you got to try to stick on them quick. I find that Sarah is the worst for always getting under my feet. Like she's like, I got to follow you everywhere. I'm like, yeah, we're in the same room still. Just relax. Let's get over here to this one. Oh, one more. Come on. Are you kidding me? And back again. It's not usually this. Some of them aren't this, this long. Because it clicks off pretty quick. You got to be use your boost. And that's it. That one will get it for us. As you can hear, the music ramped up. Now we're going to go inside to these, uh, I guess this, not a sphere. We're going to go into this little portal. Let's go check it out. We're going to use our power from beyond. It gives us the sight of all knowing space. Um, what do we have in here? They are. What did we unlock? We got moon form. All right. Moon form. Moon form channels the energy of Luna, Earth's beautiful moon, to be an, as unmovable and resilient as stone. All right. We're going to take it on to one of these guardians because I want all those. Oh, he's got a multiplier guy. Cool. That's cool. Now, using this, this one, get out of uh, Get out of here, duplicate. I don't know how, how, if I like the moon form. It just locks, anchors you right into place. Well, 
that's it guys you gotta let me know down in the comments below if moon form is going to be your thing it kind of anchors you and makes you pretty much like a stone i guess that's good if you're doing hand-to-hand -hand combat but it has its peaks and valleys but we got one more down we only got a couple more to go so until next time guys stay safe keep gaming and like always unlock your rage